There's so much. Do you, so, yeah, there is. There's so much to look back on. To a Being a pop motion, star, I, I mean, it was a very difficult it. thing to sort of, you know, to crack, really, but you certainly cracked the world of pop. Being a pop star, did it live up to everything that you sort of expected it to be? Well, I think you have, you know, you have dreams, and if you're lucky enough to make them become reality, then you're it's special anyway. And it is everything it is, uh, that I expected it to be and more, you know, good and bad. But uh, for me to get to travel around the world through the gift of music and be in a wonderful band like Wet Wet Wet, and, you know, to have mm. that experience and share it all in your early 20s and 30s, you know, to just, you know, to entertain people, play the Hollywood Bowl or Madison Square Gardens or the Buddha Can, and, uh, you know, see the world, it's fantastic. And a few bars too. <laughs> <laughs> and to have one of the all-time worldwide greatest hits and love is all around. With love is all around, yeah, which was, uh, you know, from taken from the movie Four Weddings and a Funeral. Yeah. Who would have thought? Sometimes you get these songs that just kind of pop up and just go, you know, just sell gazillions. You can't make them quick well, Wasn't there a time when it was number one for so long that you just didn't want it to be number one anymore? You said, we're not going on top of the pops anymore. Well, we're it's sick of it ourselves. Well, at the time we were uh, making a new album, the pitch of this album, and it was like, you know, it was taking us out of the studio. We had to leave Capri every night, every, every week, uh, which, is, which was rough, you know, and it's a beautiful little <laughs> island. It? But anyway, it was great to have the success of 14 weeks uh, or 15 weeks or whatever it was at number one, but it's nice to give someone else a shot. Yeah, and Reg Presley was very pleased. From I Trump, who wrote it, wasn't he? I He's dare made a few say he out was, yeah. I think he made up a, a, a few quid on that one, yes. Now, you've arrived with presents this morning. Thank you very much. What's this? This is your latest, is it? Well, no, this is the, uh, uh, just before Christmas, I uh, released another Greatest Hits, which was from the Wet 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 uh, repertoire, and it was just my interpretation of some of the favourite songs and uh, some of the fans' favourite songs. I just put a different slant on them mm. and a little twist to them. Mm -hmm. and, and what's next, Marty? I mean, we, we've had a bit of a Chicago theme here the last two days. We've been talking, been talking about the film. It's, it's, it's transferred been amazing. To absolutely. Well, it's, be it's so beautifully written in its class. It's a very sophisticated and essential um, uh, musical and I think it works and it just goes to show you they can get into the genre of films too and it bring a lot of enjoyment to people. So what kind of commitment have you given to Broadway then? Have you going over there for a long time? Or yeah, I'm going, going over there for a couple here? of months. Yeah, okay. I'm going over there for a couple of months and then I come back and I'm going to Dublin. I'm going to take the show to Dublin. I'm spending some time in Manchester and Liverpool and then I, I believe I might go to Tokyo with it. And then I'll finish and release a new album, which is ready anyway. And then you'll come back and tell us and all about I'll, it on Then Breakfast I'll come back again. and tour the UK doing my own stuff, yes. That's wonderful. Thank you ever so much. Have you got the money? <laughs> <laughs> no, but what for? For the no, CD? No, the CD. no, for the pop, so yes. <laughs> Very good luck to you. Thanks ever so much. Right, we'll be, we'll be um, following you with great... Thank Hello, you. thank you.